I'm here with Mr. Samuel L. Jackson talking about the piano lesson, the revival of the piano lesson at the Barrymore Theater. So my first question for you is, how is this show different 22 years later? I'm older. <laughs> it, it hurts more to do it mm. and stand up that long. Mm. But, you know, it's just a different cast, uh, different director. My wife's approach is very different than um, Lloyd's approach when I was doing it. Um, and... Um, I don't know. Being a being a being a supporting character as opposed to the engine that runs the play mm -hmm. uh, is uh, sort of different, but yeah. kind of great because we want to make sure that uh, John David has the best supporting cast around him that he can. Uh, it's a very important uh, piece of work uh, in terms of understanding generational wealth. Sometimes the sacrifices that one must make to to improve the the future of a family. Uh, and it's going to be fun for yeah. audiences to come and watch us. Yeah, and what do you want audiences to take away from when coming to see the piano lesson? Uh, first of all, that the, the object lesson of the play is there, that sometimes making a sacrifice uh, to help someone is not you know, the most viable uh, thing to do, and that um, Hopefully they're seeing the birth of uh, John David's stage career along with, uh, you know, his film career. Yeah, and my last question for you is, can you play the piano? Me? Yeah. Uh, I learned to play the piano for a film called Caveman's Valentine, but I don't play all the time. Nice. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. For more information on August Wilson's Pulitzer Prize winning The Piano Lesson, beginning previews on September 19th, visit pianolessonplay.com.